Hi guys, today our topic is all about anthurium. Yes, it is all about anthurium. I hope you can learn many details throughout this video series. Anthurium is a very beautiful plant where I always love to grow in my home garden. This plant is suitable as an outdoor plant and also as an indoor plant. The genus Anthurium contains many species. Among that, flowering Anthurium is called as Andriana. The common name is tail flower and in some areas it is called as flamingo flower. Anthurium is belongs to family Araceae. The popular Andriana red variety is called as crinkle Anthurium, which you can easily identify with the crinkle appearance. Anthurium is an evergreen perennial plant, and this plant is having heart shaped, attractive green leaves and a very beautiful, colorful flower. Even though we called anthurium as a flower, it is an inflorescence which is covered by a colorful waxy spathe. The inflorescence is called as spadix. In this diagram, you can see the parts of anthurium flower. In my garden, I have few colors of anthurium such as red, orange, purple, maroon and bicolor which you can see throughout this video. The color, beautiful plant, is called as anthurium, uh, baby anthurium plant. Uh, normally it is producing a very small flower uh, so because of that we cannot use this uh, plant for the decorative purposes but, but we can use this as a landscaping plant and also as an indoor plant other beautiful um, variety which is in my garden is this red uh, and green color mixed variety which is called as a bicolor variety uh, and also I have another bicolor variety which is mixed with pink color and green color so these two varieties are also very beautiful which can give a very spectacular look to your garden so we'll discuss uh, the uses of anthurium we know anthurium is a decorative plant where we can grow as an indoor and outdoor uh, plant and also this plant is ensure a healthy environment also this plant is helped to remove toxic substances such as ammonia and benzene from air so you can use this plant uh, as an indoor plant uh, and also as a air purifier for the beginners I would like to share this information. This plant is containing calcium oxalate crystals, which is called as an irritant. Normally, uh, this compound is uh, consisting the leaves, stalk, and the sap of the anthurium plant. So, uh, if you have very sensitive skin, you have to be careful when you're handling these anthurium plants. So I hope for the beginners that information is useful. So this video series is containing with another 5 short videos of Anthurium as a beginner's guide. Each video will be about 2 minutes. I hope you can learn many details within that 2 minutes time. So I will meet you soon with another video. Until that, bye bye.